Nigerian jollof or Ghanaian jollof. Now you're tra- you guys are trying to get me in a lot of trouble here and start a civil war. Here in Ghana, because we've got a, a watch party that's taking place, Arsenal versus West Ham, and also we've come in to meet Ghanaian Arsenal fans, so that's why we're here in Ghana. If I didn't support Arsenal, I'd support Arsenal ladies. Or if I didn't support Arsenal ladies, I'd support Arsenal, uh, well, under 23s. It's only Arsenal for me. AFCON 2023, I have to support Ghana, but you know what I mean, I was very disappointed actually that they didn't make it all the way. Um, I have to say, I wouldn't mind Ivory Coast winning it, just for the whole way they've gone through the tournament and the fact that they're playing it at home. I think it'd be wonderful if they won it. You are not serious. Do you think I'm here to waste all of my time? Eh? How we deal with you? It's a question that I get asked a lot since I've been here. Um, Nigerian jollof or Ghanaian jollof? Now, you're tra- you guys are trying to get me in a lot of trouble here and start a civil war back in England, yeah? Because I've already had people calling me from England, Nigerian, saying, Robbie, if you dare say Nigerian jollof. But I have to say, the Nigerian jollof has been, it's been beautiful. Um, I'm going to sit on the fence. <laughs> I can't say nothing, right? Because I have to go back home after this, but they've been both wonderful. Also win the Premier League. It's going to be really tough, you know. Um, you know, you've got Manchester City, you've got Liverpool, you know, and also there's other teams in and around it that can take points. But I think Arsenal have got a good chance. I can't guarantee that we're going to win it, but I think Arsenal have got a very good chance of winning the league this season. So I'm Robbie Lyle, AFTV, and I hope I've answered your five questions. Mm-hmm.